Yes, how are y'all doing today? Uh, today, I'm showing you um, how I took my, my dude to the hospital. You know, we went to the hospital the other day. It was uh, it was Wednesday that we went to the hospital. Uh, before I say anything, I like to uh, let you guys know that uh, in the emergency uh, out here going to the ER uh, sucks. You know, it's worse than uh, being in the ER in America. So yeah, here we are. You know, I brought him over there on Wednesday. Uh, they did. Uh, they gave him a physical, and uh, do some. They ran some 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 type of uh, test on him. And the doctor scheduled him for Wednesday uh, next week. So in a couple of days, uh, the doctor scheduled him for Wednesday. Uh, Wednesday is when he's going to get his surgery, his operation. So uh, this right here is uh, is this right here is the emergency for people who are uh, coming in for surgery. Uh, over there is the general uh, uh, emergency room, like uh, waiting waiting room. Uh, they let people. Uh, you you gotta sit outside. Uh, uh, just because uh, the, the the weather is perfect out uh, here, so you know you could have you could afford to have the waiting room outside because, uh, like I said, uh, the weather is perfect. But um. This uh, waiting room uh, here is for those who are getting uh, surgery. So he came in. Uh, they did a little work, some testing on him, and uh, when it was done with all the testing, uh, they uh, schedule him for Wednesday. So Wednesday uh, in this week coming up, that's when uh, he's going to uh, get that operation. On him, and he'll he'll be uh, staying at the hospital for a little bit, maybe two weeks, three weeks. I don't know how, I don't know for how long. But this right here is the hospital. We are at the hospital right here. I will uh, show you uh, a little more of the infrastructure of hospital uh, when we go there on Wednesday. You know, uh, people are filling in. Uh, uh, um, this is like I said. This is the ER for those who are getting a surgery, and like I said, um, customer service uh, sucks. Customer service sucks out right here. I mean, there's one doctor for like for like five thousand people. For every five thousand people, there's like one doctor. Uh, the good thing is, uh, people in Africa don't usually go to the hospital. Uh, they get their medicine in their backyard. So. Uh, only in emergency cases where uh, you would see people go to the hospital in Africa. For the most part, people don't go to the hospital. Their doctor, I mean, their medicine is right in their back in their uh, backyard. So it's really uh, hard to see uh, people uh, going to the hospital in Africa. You know, they got a couple of ambulances, but only uh, when it comes to emergency uh, situation where you would see uh, people go to the hospital. But in the meantime, they'll uh, make sure to keep, uh, uh, make sure to go to the description. The link for the GoFundMe is in there. You know, we are not that far from uh, reaching the threshold and we need to do that uh, to get it over with. Also, I already I paid for everything, so my man is all uh, good to go. I think his wife is going to be uh, the happiest uh, when he, uh, he gets better. You know, I don't know if it's uh, if she's like cheated on him, but I know that uh, her husband uh, is going to be back after the whole uh, surgery, after the whole operation. So, uh, you know, for that, you know. Uh, the things are everything is set in motion, and my man is gonna get his uh, his surgery 
uh, pray for him that uh, nothing bad happened, that he comes out you know, better than he is right uh, he is right now. But uh, uh, hit the description and thank you for all those who have donated. I mean, your money is helping this man a lot. You know, this is your money at work. You know, this man is going to uh, get a better uh, second chance to life. You know, and that's thanks uh, to you. You know, uh, y'all made it uh, possible. You know, the GoFundMe link is in the description. You know, click on the description of the video. Click on the link and uh, make some uh, make some donations. You know, we need those uh, donations to get this over with. You know, uh, we do really need those. Uh, we are not that far though. You know, we are almost uh, there. So um, click on the description to go for me. Link is in there. You know, make a small contribution and uh, let's uh, finish up with what uh, we have started. But one thing is for sure though, I paid for everything, everything is already paid. And the only thing that's left now is for the, the doctor to work on him and you know get him uh, on his feet again, you know. So uh, this, this right here is uh, the hospital. And like I said, uh, Wednesday when we go back, I will be uh, showing you uh, more of the infrastructure at this hospital. So stay tuned on that. I want to show you how the uh, hospital uh, do look out here, you know. And like I said, the emergency room is outside because the weather is perfect. You don't need to keep people in, you know. So uh, like, share, subscribe. Uh, the man is being helped, and that's what we all need, uh, you know. Uh, from from time to time, well, you know, helping somebody actually makes you uh, feel good. So we are at the hospital. Wednesday coming up next Wednesday, he's gonna get his operation, and then he's going to rest for like two, three weeks at the hospital. And after that, I think he will be back to what he used to be. Like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.